Hello everyone, my name is Bion Ismahasan. I am Bunun Kiwetis from Takanua community, Namasha of Kaohsiun in the southern part of Taiwan. It is my greatest honor to invite you to visit my latest exhibition at Taiwan Indigenous People Cultural Park in Pingdong. The exhibition is Resurgent and Solidarity Indigenous Taiwanese Women Art. At the core of this exhibition is the need for Indigenous women's togetherness. Togetherness as the life practice and togetherness as a methodology, whether that be curatorial approach or personal philosophy. Decolonizing Indigenous Taiwanese contemporary art must include privileging the voices and input of indigenous women artists. By bringing together the voices of respected elders and three very powerful women artists, including Piyu Mayan Nation, Mile Mafaliu, Lukai Nation, Alindulan, and Paiwan Nation, Arai Gumagan. This exhibition generates togetherness through the chance indigenous cultural exchanges across generations. It is about transmission of knowledge between people, land, and river. Today, the right of the women, the protection of elders, and environmental concern are critical for many indigenous Taiwanese women. There is a powerful sense of their search for new unexplored possibilities as they strive to carve out a place for themselves and escape or departures from the familiar and the constraint of the COVID-19 pandemic. They deliberately located themselves in the forum of alien environment with an awareness of their differences. Finding connections experimenting with intensities. The others in this exhibition, all of whom identify as feminists, make these journeys from the specific starting point of native community experience. Their sovereign words and concern about environmental reciprocity. The core of this exhibition is the need for women's togetherness because we need to unite. The women have long been the driving creative force behind indigenous Taiwanese art. Yet their individual contributions has been largely unrecognized, treated as autonomous representation of entire cultures. Walking through togetherness, this exhibition aims to gather the physical experiences and the life stories of the women artists to share their viewpoints in creative ways, to throw new light on perennial concern, and to discuss new concerns in ways informed by tradition. In the global space of disorders, decline, obscurities, and alienation, it initiates an alternative culture and a way of being together. A woman's voice is like the drop of the water, and the voices of the group of the women can be condensed into the power of the river, amplifying their individual voices and blowing collectively in the space. The female body is the first dwelling place for human beings to enter this world. Their own energy is strong and gentle. In every generation, they exist quietly and solidly. Through the powerful object in their hands, they project the inner heart of the women. Lived and subconscious experiences are gradually pieced together in their life journey, responding to the texture of ethnic cultural memory and to drastic change in the environment. I maintain an indigenous centrism as the counterpoint to stress 
the production of knowledge about curatorial decoloniality. As Anabesh curators from Canada First Nation, Wanda Anabesh asserts, the words like return, resurgence, and rewriting all have embedded in them a colonial idea of time, where we have not have a continuity, and contemporaneity, or even modernity. Even if otherwise than its European versions, resurgence and solidarity, Indigenous Taiwanese women art connects any process of decolonization of Indigenous curatorial practice to question what the place of a sector in the colonial matrix of power, a machine that generates injustice, disavow, silent at all levels. By articulating performative utonist and visualizing sovereignty of indigenous land, female activism, their female resistance, embodied cultures and communities. My curatorial methodology of their personal philosophy so bring together of the very features of the curatorial group as about curating together. I would say togetherness. As to actually the fundamental core values of being indigenous curators, this exhibition attempts to explore the artistic process of acceptance, shift, and expansion from the creation of personal experience, life memory, and cultural change. It asks how time and history might be compressed and condensed. Into the spatial models of the women unity through life experience in the gender's body, question about the disappearance of class and culture, the women's right to speak, and environmental care are of the vital importance to many female authors. They are familiar with trauma, and their art offers at once responses and an escape. This exhibition consists of four such things, including environmental reciprocity, cultural landscape, turning after healing, and the power of object. These things respond to the core spirit of the entire exhibition through the words of the very powerful Indigenous Taiwanese women artists. The exhibition integrates these things. Through their careful, deep exploration through art, offering new perspectives through the activation of female artistic unity. Oh, yeah.